Hi, this is Dr. Adam Garber, one of the obstetricians here at the Civic Campus. We know it is very stressful to think about your delivery in these strange times, so we made this virtual walkthrough to try to give you an idea of what to expect when you're expecting during a pandemic. Uh, I don't have an appointment, uh, but I think I'm in labor. Okay. I'll just have to ask you a few questions before I send you up. Okay. In the past 14 days, have you traveled outside of Canada? I have not. No, you haven't been in contact with anybody who's tested positive for COVID-19? Thankfully, no. No, nobody's coughing in your house or has been traveling? Nope. And you yourself, have, have you had any fever, chills, cough, cold? No. Nope. Okay. And nope. you know how to get there? I, I do, yeah, down okay. to the, is Perfect. it the D elevators, right? Exactly, yeah. So I'll just get you to wash your hands right here. Okay. And uh, you can head up, okay? Okay, thank you very much. Thanks. How are you? I'm all right. I think I'm in labor. Okay. I'm just going to ask you a few questions before you head to the delivery room. Your initials? GP. Okay. And have you already been tested for COVID-19? No. Have you traveled outside of Canada in the last two weeks? I have not. Have you traveled in the last month outside of Canada? No. Have you been in contact with anyone who has traveled outside of Canada? No. Do you have a cough? Not at all. Or any shortness of breath? Nope. Any congestion, runny nose, or sore throat? Nope. Have you been in contact with anyone with a runny nose, sore throat, or cough? Nope. Any fever or chills? Nope. Have you been in contact with anyone in your household who has been unwell with fever or chills? Nope. Have you been diagnosed in the last month with a respiratory illness? Nope. Are you on any antibiotics? I am not. And how are you feeling in general? I'm fine, other than the contractions. Okay, you're doing very well. Thank you. Um, have you been in close contact with anyone with, who's tested positive for COVID-19? No, thankfully. And have you been hospitalized outside of Canada in the last 12 months? No. All right. So the next thing I'm going to do is take your temperature. Okay. Uh, you can take one of the masks here that have been made by volunteers. Thank you. And there's also instructions on how to clean them. Those are lovely. And once the uh, your temperature is done, you can head through the doors and to the left. All right, and there we go. Thanks. So we'll just drop this down. Now you need this paper piece of paper to get through the doors. So as you go through the doors, go to your left. There's a stop sign on the floor. They will ask you more questions. And good luck with everything. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, I'm all registered.
going to go to room 14. There'll be a nurse there waiting. Okay, you, okay? great. Thank you. Okay, your nurse should be in shortly. Hi, my name's Ava. I'm going to be your nurse today. I'm going to take care of you for the rest of the shift. Hi, Ava. Thanks Hi. for taking care of me. <laughs> Come on in. Hi, I'm Dr. Smithies. I'm the OB on call today. Um, I'm wearing a mask, as you can see. Um, when it's time to push, I'll be wearing a bit more gear. Okay, thanks for taking care of me. Hi. Hi, it's Robin. Remember, we met at clinic. Yeah. I'm covering. I'm on call today. Awesome. It's nice to see you. Me too. So this is what I'm wearing for right now. And when things move along and you're getting ready to start pushing, I'm going to put a gown on and be in a bit more of a get-up. Okay. Sounds it's, okay? It's great. Okay. All right, so we're fully dilated. It's time to start pushing. You'll notice I'm wearing a bit more equipment than usual, but we're going to have a baby soon. Well, it's very exciting. I still recognize you. <laughs> 